Hello everyone, today we are going to be using the Ortho Workstation. This is a gel analyzer, it's semi-automated. Uh, the first thing that you're going to do when you come in, just like a dry block, would be to turn this on. The um, button is in the back. So the power button is in the back here. So you flip that switch, and as soon as you do, you'll notice it'll start um, doing some loopy stuff, and then um, it says, okay, I'm gonna start heating now. All right, so as soon as the lights start blinking, you can press the go, and then it's gonna start heating, but also the time frames for all of the parts of the device are going to show. So if you notice, <clears throat> you've got two sets of 15 minutes here. If we open the lid, this is our incubator. All right, so we have slots for gel cards. And if you are putting in a gel card that you're running, you would uh, put your gel card into the slot that you want. Make sure it's nice and flush. Okay. And then um, what would happen there is you would close the, close the lid so that the heat stays in and you would press the go button and it'll start to count down. If you don't press that go button, it's not going to count down and it's going to be in there forever and <laughs> you're not going to you're not gonna remember how long it's been in. So uh, we'll take that out and there's my gel card. You close it nice and gently. And then in order to open this guy up, see it locks, you're going to need to flip this, uh, slide this uh, toggle to the right and then open up the lid. You'll put your gel card in and even though I have my gel card in, it is a centrifuge, right? So you need to balance across the rotor, all right? Close gently, all right? It won't close all the way unless you slam it or move the toggle over to the right. I suggest moving it over to the right. Um, then we have the go button right here. You'll press go, it'll start to spin. Okay, and count down just like your uh, heating elements over here. Now, um, we don't ever really want to press stop because it jerks it uh, completely stop. Uh, with, that, with a centrifuge, you always want to, um, you know, break it slowly and it gives you an error right here. Um, but I'm just doing that for the video so you could see what it looked like. All right, now I press stop again. It goes back to um, the normal RPMs um, at a resting state and it's at the, um, the ready position. So I am going to do a couple of procedures today. Uh, so look for the follow up videos, but while it's heating, I'm just going to get ready for those other procedures. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.